superstar soprano graces the stage at the Lyric Opera, and the working man gets the star treatment at the Evanston Theater. Here he is, Chris <laughs> Jones, on set to take us on stage. Yes, so, my indeed. Friend. How are you all doing? Well, at the Lyric Opera, the singular voice of Renee Fleming can be heard in a really gorgeous musical by Adam Geddel. It's called The Light in the Piazza. It's an elegant, sophisticated show, perfect for anybody wanting to inject a little class into their personal roster of holiday entertainment. Set in Italy in the 1950s, this is the story of a mother who travels on vacation with her special needs daughter, only to find the beautiful young woman falls in love with a handsome Italian. Should she continue to protect her daughter or allow her to find happiness on her own? Those are the questions expressed in beautiful, romantic music. When I was younger, I was she, the innocence of fantasy, but it's okay. The light in the piazza gets four stars. Won't you let me go in peace? In total contrast, Theo Ubique Theatre is doing a gritty, made in Chicago production of the classic Studs Terkel musical Working. This is a celebration of ordinary blue collar Chicagoans, housekeepers, iron workers, housewives, and delivery guys. The songs by James Taylor and others are great, and at this time of year, this shows a great reminder of how much we need people to keep on working while we all celebrate. Working gets three and a half stars. Thank God for delivery! All right, so a light at the piazzas at the Lyric Opera. That's until December the 29th. Renee Fleming, very cool. 35 to $219. And workings at the Theo Ubique Cabaret Theater. That's on Evanston, Chicago, Board One Howard through January the 26th. Tickets there, 37 to 83 bucks. You can eat your toddler charcuterie and then <laughs> yes. go to the theater. <laughs> that's excellent. Yeah, you could probably be a little hungry after. Yeah, yeah I think so. 